Hello everybody, Joan here. We'll be looking at possible metallic wreckage that was photographed by the Rover Curiosity on Sol 4098. Let's have a look at the source and we'll have a look at the anomalies up close. So the mast cam or mast camera took this photograph on the 15th of February 2024, Sol 4098. And we'll be having a look at the strange anomalies at the top of the photograph and one to the bottom right. So there's the photograph downloaded directly from the NASA site and as I showed you recently you'll see there's the strange grid that's applied to the photograph and that is biofilter encoding which encodes the color photograph to grayscale. So let's have a look at this photograph that's been decoded for us into a color version. You'll find this on the analyst's notebook and to gain access to the photograph in this notebook you need to sign in. It's free folks, I encourage you to do it. So this notebook is affiliated to NASA and the photographs were obtained from the planetary data system. So these are totally legitimate photographs, folks. This is also used by researchers and scientists quite extensively. So let's have a look at that photograph downloaded from the PDS. So there it is, folks, Sol 4098. And here's the color version that's already been color processed for us. So I don't need to run it through the DaVinci Resolve DCTL script. And there's the photograph downloaded from the site and I need to remove the red filter. See I've removed the red filter and the colors match those that you can see in the analyst's notebook version. So let's have a look at each of these up close. Let's start with the one highlighted there. Check this out, folks. To me, this looks like some type of metal. You can see it's been sort of ripped. And then it's bent over here as well. That's strange curvature and it seems to be reflecting the Martian surface and the sky. It's difficult to tell that's what it looks like to me, folks. Let's have a look at that strange item. I don't know what to make of this thing. It seems to be ripped as well. On the one side, it's got this strange curvature to it. And that looks like a pipe coupling to me. Let's have a closer look. So what could this be? Some type of uh, container? It's been ripped over here as I say. Parts curved in. This part sticking out on the side. And then that pipe sort of like an elbow joint over here to the right. Right, let's have a look at the two anomalies highlighted there. We'll have a look at this one and the one to the top. It's got a strange protruding part. It looks like a little winglet. I don't know what to make of that, folks. And then this looks like 
some type of containment vessel. It's open, perhaps that part there is like a lid that covers that opening. Up next, the part highlighted there. And it looks totally out of place as well. There's one of those greyish boulders. You can see the natural pattern on it that you'd see in a rock or a boulder. But this piece is highly reflective, very smooth. It's got a very thin appearance. And it also seems to be reflecting the Martian sky and the surface. And then the strange item highlighted there. To me this looks like a sculpted piece. Perhaps a head and a face. Nose there, eye, yeah. Chin over there. Perhaps pareidolia folks, but this looks highly unusual as well. Right, so here's the color photograph. And uh, I've upscaled it. I'll include the link to this upscaled gigapan in the video description. So you can download this and check it out for yourself. So to me, folks, this looks like metallic wreckage. Get this. It looks like ripped sheet metal. Bent of, yeah, it looks like it's reflective as well. Reflecting the surface there and the sky of here. Hard to tell, but that looks very metallic. But this, check that out. This looks like some type of container with a pipe. And it's been ripped open over here on the left. Piece is dented in, this piece is torn out, pointing out, yeah. Don't know what the heck to make of these things, guys. That looks like a sculpture of a face or a head. Pareidolia, perhaps, but that's also quite fascinating. Check out this piece. Also very highly reflective. Looks like it's reflecting the atmosphere or the sky of Mars there. As I shall include the link to this in the video description and then this. It's got like a grid, ribbed like design to it. a lot of this jagged, very thin material with these jagged edges. Let's check out these odd pieces. Let's go up to the top. There's something interesting there as well. Check that out. This protruding part. It looks like a little winglet or something sticking out of that piece and then this looks like this is open he has the potential lid that covers that opening some type of container who knows but this to me folks doesn't look like a typical rock or boulder And then this, what do you make of this thing? I look forward to reading your comments. Could this be 
wreckage that we're looking at here, facts. It sure looks like it to me. I hope you enjoyed this brief presentation looking at possible metallic wreckage on Mars and then that strange sculpted part. I don't know what to make of those folks. Let's have a chat in the comments. I'd love to hear what you think of these. As always, thanks for watching.